guarantee she is. I love them tigers. Uh -huh. <laughs> but now, you were born where? Where were you born? I was born in Tulsa. Tulsa. And uh, so, you just played the guitar yourself, or did you have lessons? I had actually just two lessons, and then the rest of it was self-taught. Uh -huh. So you sit around in the bedroom, and after you do your homework, Mom would let you play the guitar. I actually picked it up about two years ago, and I had already graduated then. So there was no homework. <laughs> I see. But, uh, yeah, I just sit in the bedroom and plunk around on it. Well, now, I'm still me, San Francisco, Paper Hearts, Red Candles, and Break My Heart Away. You've written these songs, right? Yes, I wrote all those songs, and uh, that uh, particular album there I recorded with Mark Williams from Into Soul Entertainment in Los Angeles, mm -hmm. and uh, now how I got to work with him was that I went to Los Angeles in summer of 2011, and they had this big convention that's called the International Presentation of Performers, and I was there for acting and singing, and what you do is uh, it's about five days of um, auditions for the top executives and producers and all that in the industry. And uh, so you're performing for all these people and pretty much trying to get a break. Mm -hmm. And uh, I got lucky and uh, uh, Mark saw me singing a Bonnie Raitt song. And uh, Mark has worked with Madonna and Janet Jackson and several other people. And uh, he approached me with a uh, idea to record an EP and film a music video, and uh, I ran with it. <laughs> so you have a video out, too? Yes, you? I do. I have a music video for I'm Still Me. I'm Still Me. That was my debut single. Well, we're getting ready to call Doc Holiday. I bet he's going to be excited. What are you doing calling me, boy? Doc, you remember me? I was going to be kicked out of country music. Who are you? I'm George Jones, in case you're wondering. Doc may not be up. It's a little early for Doc. I think he's in Los Angeles yeah. right now. Is he in, well, if that's his cell phone, then it'll take a while. It'll have to search him out. <laughs> it, it, it'll be funny. He wakes up in a motel room and goes, oh, hello. <laughs> Doc Holliday, you don't know me from Adam. This is Paul Brown from Okmulgee, Oklahoma, and I have Sarah Bennett and Big D in my studios, and today is your birthday, and we want to be a wishing you a happy birthday, big boy. If you want to call us back before 8 o'clock, if you get up and shower and brush your teeth, <laughs> you can call us at 918-756-5400. Happy birthday, Doc. Y'all say happy birthday, too. Happy, happy birthday. Happy birthday. Bye. All right, we got that all in now, and Doc's going to say, you ain't going to believe the call I got. <laughs> <laughs> Anyhow, uh, we're going to break away here. We're going to have Sarah on the other side of the show. We're going to keep her with us on all hour. And um, Sarah Bennett, she is a country and western singer, and I like her style. I really do. I like the way you sing. I like the way the music, it's just like Big D said, it's a foot patting music. And that's 90% of a sale. If you make somebody feel good in their heart, they'll pat their foot and listen to your music. Yeah, so you're, you're, you're wanting to aspire to be Country Music Entertainer of the Year. That would be pretty dang awesome. <laughs> well, you, just, you stay after it and it'll happen. I believe she's heading right for it, too. Yeah. You know, I, I'm going to say, to one of the things about it, you have a tremendous personality. You have a good mic presence. And, of course, you're pleasant to look at. Big D thinks you're beautiful. <laughs> And, uh, well, I sure appreciate that. Well, you are. You're a beautiful girl. Thank and, you. and uh, you know, you got a road to hold because everybody wants to get in country music, but only a very few. But I think with Doc Holliday, you've got a pretty good in down in Nashville. That'll help you out a lot. He's the best there is. He produces a lot of major artists every year. Yeah, major maybe you and Big D need to get together and do a duet. Yeah, we've been talking about it. Yeah, Big D wrote one called Idiot. You know why he wrote that, don't Oh, you? yeah. <laughs> because of me, that's it. <laughs> you know, I mean, there's, a, there's an unwritten thing about the idiot situation. We won't go into that right now. I see there's an unwritten thing about them saying idiot. Right? Long distance DT idiots. <laughs> So now, how did mom and dad go away to Nashville? 
My mom went with me. Mom, with, mom, with, mom, with, mom, with, mom with, if I can talk, you know. <laughs> but you know, you're sort of like uh, the guy that can touch it, stutter, <laughs> except of a male tell us. But when he sings, he does a great job. Anyway, we're going to have to break away for a little news. We'll be back on the other side with Big D and Sarah Bennett. Both of them want to sing country. Requests for increases in state funding. Uh, we'll be back on a 25 till, so if y'all need to get a drink, you've got to run around the building. I'm a little bit. Okay,